Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Security Lock feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Motorola Moto G7 Play that is originally from Boost Mobile here in the US. And this is a device that does indeed have the Google account lock enabled because as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the device was reset and to continue, we have to sign in with a Google account that was previously on the device. And so that's basically what the Google lock consists of is when you factory reset the device without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's going to ask you to log into that account again as a security measure after the factory reset has been performed. So we've been contacted by tons of customers from all over the world asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information, or because they were sold the device by a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the lock was enabled. Enabled. And then after the purchase, obviously the buyer didn't have the login information for the account and the seller has usually long since disappeared in those cases because it's a very common scam that happens all the time these days with the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to remove this exact type of lock from this model without having to have the previous Google login information. It's actually something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer and and the great thing about this process is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we did right here to this one. So as you could very clearly see, the device was on the Google lock page, but we had actually already done 99% of the work of removing it before even starting the video, just so we can keep it as short as possible. So then all I had to do was unplug it and restart the phone. And now that we had done all of those steps previously, now we can see that the device boots up straight to the home screen going through the rest of the setup process completely. So we have full access to all of the apps and settings and features, and it is just like a brand new device that never had the Google lock on there. While I'm here, I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we are working with after I turn down the volume for those initial notifications. And if we go in there and then under system, and then we go to about, there we go. And the device name that we can see here is the Moto G7 Play. And then the model number here, the specific device that we're working with here, the XT1952-4. So that is the G7 Play on Boost Mobile. I know the Boost logo was visible there when the phone was turning on, so you could see that, so that confirms exactly which model this is. So, if you have one of these exact same models and need help getting the Google Lock removed from it, we would love to help you out with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and we'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will also enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.